Hello, today we have Jack Liu, Head of Corporate Development at Inos, trading on the NASDAQ under the ticker AIMD. Jack, welcome to the show. Thank you for having me. AI has transformed how machines see and hear, but smell has remained untapped. With AI knows, Inos is changing that. Could you walk us through the problem you're solving and why this technology matters now more than ever? Right, um, great questions. So you know how AI already can see, hear, and speak, but it's never been able to smell really until now. And that's what we built. At iNose, we're creating technologies that let machines understand smells just like a human nose. We call it AI nose. And it turns scent into digital data. We call this data smell ID, like face ID, but for scent. So this isn't really just some cool tech, it's useful. From catching signs of illness early to spotting chemical issues in factories, AI knows adds a whole new sense to the AI. It's like giving robots and smart devices the ability to smell their surroundings and respond. We believe this is the next big leap in AI, and I knows is leading this charge. We're building an ecosystem for smell tech, and we are open to collaborate with other companies. You're operating across three diverse markets, healthcare, industrials, as you mentioned, and robotics. How are these verticals leveraging AI knows today and what makes them ideal entry points for your platform? Right, so in healthcare, we're working on two very exciting projects. In Japan, we're using AI knows in senior care, working with the leading senior care operator in the country. These devices can detect certain scent changes associated with bowel movements, helping caregivers take actions, earlier and reduce workload. We're also developing Inos Flora. This is a simple, non-invasive smell-based test for women's health. It's in clinical trials in Taiwan. For industrials, we're partnering with the world's largest chip packaging and testing company to bring AI nodes into their smart factories. The goal, catch chemical issues early, improve predictive maintenance, optimizing manufacturing processes. Finally, in robotics, we teamed up with Yugo. This is Japan's leading service robot company. The robots are now already deployed in public areas and factories. And now we are upgrading Yugo, Yugo's robots to detect environmental changes like waste, gas leaks, and beyond. You mentioned partnerships with a global semiconductor leader and Japan's top service robot firm. What strategic impact do these deals have on Inos's roadmap and market credibility? Right. These partnerships are very important validation of our AI nose technology. Our work with the world's biggest chip packaging and testing company will help factories run smarter and greener. By giving them sent data, we're adding a tool for early warnings, quality controls, and smoother operations. With Yugo, that's the Japan's leading service robot company, it's about giving robots a new superpower, the ability to smell. So their robots are helping in data centers and commercial buildings. Now with our AI nose, they can detect things human can't smell or don't want to. So these aren't small pilot programs. These are serious partners solving real world problems. It shows that turning scent into data has a big time demand. From ICU breath samples to industrial gas detection, AI nose has evolved rapidly. I think you'll agree, Jack. Now, could you share a bit more about the journey behind this technology and how has your team built such a deep moat? Right, it all started in healthcare. Our first use case for AI nose was for detecting pneumonia in ventilated ICU patients just from analyzing their breath. So we always believe AI nose has a very broad potential. We expanded into women's health and elderly care. And around second half of last year, we started pushing into industrials and robotics. So now we're even training AI nodes to smell fruits, coffee, overheating cables, you know, the real world stuff. This elevates its potential to a whole new level. So we don't just build a device, we're building a full stack, sensors that are semiconductor, man-based, portable AI models, and nearly 13 years of proprietary scent data. 
And that's what gives us a strong moat in this smell take. Now, Jack, the sensing space includes both established gas sensor providers and early stage electronic nodes or e nose developers. What differentiates iNOS from these players from both a technical and commercial standpoint? All right, so most companies fell into two camps, gas sensor makers and, as you said, e nose developers. So the former gas sensor makers, they mainly sell components to detect specific gases. The latter one, the e nose developers, most of them are right now in R&D stage. So i -NOS is unique. We started in healthcare, not consumer or environmental, like these people do. Uh, we buy sensors from the best suppliers. And now, so we are their customers, not their competitors. We build our own AI that learns and adapts, and we harness nearly 13 years of innovations. So that combination of IP, know-how, and commercial traction give us a clear edge. We're not in R&D mode. We're entering deployment mode. Now, Jack, you've laid out some key timelines for pilot deployments and product launches. What milestones should investors be watching for in 2025 and beyond? Right. 2025 is a launch year for us. For industrials and robotics, we're training AI nodes in real world settings now with our partners. Pilot will begin in second half of this year, 2025, and we target commercial rollout in 2026. For healthcare, our senior care program is already in pilot in Japan with mass production targeted for mid-2025. Our women's health test right now, it's in clinical trials in Taiwan. So we just completed our first Yugo installation about a month after running, after we announced the partnerships. And that page shows our commitment to this project. 2025 is about proving the tech in market. 2026 is about scaling it. Now, finally, Jack, for investors discovering iNOS for the first time, give us the core value proposition. Specifically, why is now the right time to get excited about smell tech? We're building a whole new tech category, smell tech. With AI nodes, we're leading the way in turning scent into data and data into smarter decisions. We believe AI nodes can change how healthcare is delivered, how robots work, and how factories operate. We're already working with major partners. We've got the data, the technology, and the roadmap to bring this to the world. Computer vision took decades to reach phones and autonomous cars. We believe smell is the next big one, completely untapped. If you want to invest in the next frontier of AI, where machines can finally smell, this is the time. We want to build an ecosystem for smell ID and our AI nodes. So we invite AI, hardware, robotics company to partner with us and let's scale smell tech together. So we're iNOS, our ticker symbol is AIMD. Follow us on our social, hashtag iNOS Inc. AI couldn't smell until iNOS. Jack, thanks for being on the show with us today. Thank you for your time.